and you can see here we're just under halfway through uh, the A grade um, part of the uh, exam so very very good pause the video now and have a go okay so a lot of people sort of fade out of uh, um, the previous questions uh, and then suddenly they see a tree diagram and they think oh I can do this and, and they're right these two here and these two here and these two here always have to add up to 1 so if that's 0 0.4 that's going to have to be 0 0.6 and there's easy mark there to be had if that's 0 0.3 that's going to have to be 0 0.7 now the chance of uh, Wendy winning um, is always 0.3 so we can just copy it down here and you've got to be careful that this isn't a conditional tree diagram this is actually an independent one so we just copy the probabilities there and there across and that's absolutely fine if it's conditional then this one would be different these two would be different to these two here and that gives us two marks then it says work out the probability that Wendy wins at Hoopla and also wins on the Coconut Shy. Um, so, Wendy wins. So, if I uh, get the. Uh, so, we can have a look at Wendy wins is this one here. So, she wins at the Hoopla and then she also wins at the Coconut Shy. So, she also wins at Coconut Shy. So, it's this one and this one. Okay, so let's write that down. So we've got 0.4 there for this, and then 0.3 for this. And when you're using the word and, so let's just highlight that. So when we're using the word and, in probability that means times. And actually whenever we go across a tree diagram we're always timesing. So we need to do 0.4 times 0.3, which is going to be 0.3. One, two, and to do that, you can make that a four and that a three, which is twelve, and then put back the decimal, put back. Um, so you you times that by ten and times that by ten to make that a four and that a three. So therefore, you need to divide the twelve by ten and then to divide the tw uh, twelve by ten again. So that becomes naught point one two. So naught point one two. That's it. So let's have a look at the mark scheme. And you see here 0 0.6, just that one uh, part gives you a mark, and then the other uh, part of the tree diagram gives you the second mark, and then the working now 0 0.4 times 0 0.3, and the answer 0 0.12.